What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We are doing Jaspie's Hit Parade Big Game Super Bowl Mixer, which is a 127 box football mixer. Random teams. And again, huge hits, guys. Giveaways, hitless promo. Obviously, sell sheet hits are all right there. Potentially, what we might be able to pull here. Now, uh, the break list, the box list is in the item description. A couple cases of our exclusive Hit Parade Big Game Edition. So, those are exclusively made for us for uh, Hit Parade. Have a couple cases there of Sapphire, one of a kind, one of ones, VIP box chairman, down to some helmets and jerseys. 127 total boxes. Now, this is a 32 spot. Everybody gets a random team break. And again, at the end of the break, we will take all the names, randomize them. The top name will get a 10-box case of Hit Parade Football Case Hit Series 14, which is near a $3,000 value. Now, there is hitless protection, guys. Let's say you don't get a hit. Each hitless team will get a box of 2022 Donruss Football Hobby. Now, there is 127 boxes. I hope everybody gets a hit. But of course, since it is a repack product, some of them we curated with Hip Rate. Some of them, of course, uh, were sold, of course, like normal, limited, and, and all that stuff. So obviously, there's a chance that we might not get the cases that will have certain hits for teams. But we're obviously going to try our best to get hits for everybody. And then hits in the folder are some of the hits we can get. These aren't guaranteed to be in the break. But just a little example because there's different uh, limited editions. So... Uh, we were sharing the Google Doc with everybody here that won a mixer or bought a spot. So that's everybody there, guys. I just copied and pasted it. We did a lot of fillers, and a lot of people won spots for a fraction of the price. Thanks to all that bought straight up, though. We did sell a couple of straight up spots as well. There's uh, the teams here. I'm going to paste them in here. And here we go, guys. Good luck. Dice roll it. Three and a three, six times. Here we go, six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six times, three, three, six. Tristan at the top, down to Chad Cromwell at the bottom. And I'll get, a, I'll give it a little lengthy, uh, hit, uh, sorry, uh, trade window just in case. Um, six times here now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six times. Six, six. Colt at the top down in the Los Angeles Rams. That should be everybody there. So, Tristan, you have the Indianapolis Colts. Brian S. with the Vegas Raiders. Mike N. with the Jaguars. Aaron Billingsley with the Bills. David Lemons with the Broncos. Tristan, you have the Chargers and the Seahawks. Carl with my Eagles. Fly, Eagles, fly, baby. Go, Birds. Lee, you have the Vikings. Chad Cromwell with the Titans. Tim with the Lions. David with the Patriots. Tristan, you have the Carolina Panthers. Uh, Zach with the Browns. Sean Maddock with the Texans. Ryan with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Sean Maddock. With the Bears, Ed with the Steelers, Steve Herrick with the Packers, Jeff Henn with the Commanders, Matt Buckler with the Saints, Sean Maddock with the Ravens, Nancy with the 49ers, Copperman, whoa, no wonder you put Ha Wow. You got your Jets. All right. It's not terrible, right? All right, so Taylor, you have the Chiefs. That's last spot mojo. Justin with the Bengals, Michael Davis with the Giants, David Levins with the Cardinals, David May with the Falcons, Tristan with the Dolphins, Nico with the Cowboys, and then Chad with the Los Angeles Rams. So, again, guys, I will give you guys a few minutes here. Uh, it looks like charismatic, which is Matt Buckler, says Saints are up for trade. Um, so, if anything, what I'll do here is I'll pause the video, see if there's any trades, and then we'll we'll unpause, and then uh, we'll come back and see if there was any trades. All right, guys, welcome back. After a lengthy trade window, no trades, actually, guys. A lot of trade offers. No, no, Nobody wanted to accept the trade. So, try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo on a lot of teams here, guys. So as I was mentioning, of course, when the video was paused, uh, for the people that are watching, are also in the break. Uh, I'm not going to go in this order here. I'm just going to kind of go with, like, Vintage first, and then we'll go to Limited, to Platinum, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, and then end off with the memorabilia helmets and jerseys uh, in the break. And then, of course, at the end, I already have the list ready to roll to give away that case to one lucky winner of a $3,000 value there. 
So here we go, guys. So I did put two cases here already. Like I said, I have the vintage and I have the limited right here, graded. Then uh, right behind me, guys, I have all the product right here. Hope you guys can see that right there, right? That's all product. There cases. There's the helmets. There's the jerseys. All that good stuff. So it's all right there, guys. I'm going to just get up and grab as I go. And, of course, for the hit list, I mean, obviously, we're going to calculate that once uh, our shipping team sorts it out. But, of course, you can keep track of your hits here throughout the break in case, uh, you know, you do go hitless. I hope no one does go hitless, though. That way, everybody gets something. But, of course, you will have a little hitless protection. 2020 True Donner's Football Hobby, which actually is a new product release, uh, I think, this Wednesday. So, I think technically, uh, what is that going for, actually? It's like a $250 box. That's not too bad, right? A little hitless protection. Some, something like that, and especially for most people that obviously won these spots from a filler. Might have tried a lot, but did win some spots, maybe saved a little bit of money, so I guess it's not the worst thing. So there we go. Football Legends Graded Vintage Edition first, guys. I've actually, I don't think I've ever ripped this, this series. So, start off with that. We'll work our way to, to some of the big stuff. All right, here we go. How about a little Norm Van Brocklin? 1951 Bowman. This is a Rams edition. Out of Eugene, Oregon. So that's going to go to the Los Angeles Rams, which, let me show the list again. I think Chad tried to trade the Rams. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. There you go. On the board. There's a sell sheet for this here. Did Nick put up some cards potentially on the sell sheet? So I don't really know what the biggest card is, but maybe it'll probably just be the biggest names, right? Gail Sayers. How about that? 1966 Philadelphia, uh, which is a Bears Gail Sayers. SGC4. Very nice. All graded vintage, guys. Graded vintage. And a Frank Tarkenton. 1965 Philadelphia. Which, of course, is a Minnesota Viking. And that's a PSA 8. Frank Tarkenton right there. So that is Minnesota Vikings. Lee with that one. Yeah, this is a cool little twist in here, right? I mean, we're so used to all the modern, all the, all that kind of stuff, and then we throw in a little, little vintage here. Now, of course, for vintage, it's probably only gonna be so many teams. So, obviously, some teams might not get anything here, but you yeah, see, ooh, what a little Terry Bradshaw, 1973 tops. That's a PSA seven. Steelers with that one. That's going to Ed. We have a 1989 score, Thurman Thomas, PSA 10. Is that really vintage? I guess we're in 2023. <laughs> there you go, PSA 10. Well, I don't know, man. If they're going to put Thurman Thomas from 1989, you might have a chance. I was figuring vintage is like anything like pre-70s probably. 
I don't even know. That might be the biggest hit in here. Anybody know what a Thurman Thomas score? PSA 10 goes for? How about a 1957 Topps Raymond Berry? Colts right there. PSA 6. That's so funny though, dude. <laughs> like, we've been getting 50s, 60s, and then all of a sudden 1989. <laughs> And how about a Joe Namath? That is a SGC. Look how old SGC uh, ones used to look like. 1968 top stand-up Joe Namath. And a graded A6 for the Jets. Looks awesome. Jets is uh, Copperman. Hey. I don't know if you have one of those bad boys, but you do now. Ooh, man, these ones had a PSA 10 sell for a lot. This is actually a really nice one. 1986 Tops, Jerry Rice. This is a PSA 7, though, but I'm sure it still sells pretty well. San Francisco 49ers, Nancy with that one. Jim Brown. This is cool. 1965, Jim Brown, Cleveland Browns. And try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo Brown, Zach. Look at that. Jim Brown for the Browns. So that's a couple try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo's already in the first case. All right, last box of the vintage, guys. Good luck. And it is a Dolphins Bob Greasy, 1970 tops. PSA 8. All right. So there you go. Nice little great adventure. That was pretty fun. Now, of course, I'm going to go limited. This is 2022 Series 11. Again, I don't know exactly what the sell sheet is, but of course, these should all be pretty, pretty modern for the most part. Well, a lot of 2022 in here probably look for specific rookies and teams. Well, there is a chance at Jeff Lee Herbert's for sure in this. Even rookies, too. Uh, in, like, the graded rookies edition. All right, guys. Here we go. Well, asking you shall receive. I need to pay Manning. There you go. I'm on a 2021 Classics Peyton Manning PSA 10 numbered 24 out of 25. <laughs> That's funny. So again, this is limited graded edition, so of course everything will be graded. Ooh, how about a Kyle Pitts, Genesis. I think the Falcons were a try-to-trade, couldn't-trade mojo. So that's a super short print out of retail, PSA 9. Nice Kyle Pitts there. David May with that one. How about a little Trey Lance? Trey Lance, press proof premium. And that is a PSA 10 for the 49ers. 49ers there, Nancy. Ooh, 
Ooh, about a Josh Allen red, white, and blue prism graded a PSA nine. Bills going to Aaron Billingsley. All right, guys, halfway through after this box. And again, guys, do not worry. We're barely 15 boxes in out of 127, so panic time will probably be when we're down to like 10, 15 boxes. <laughs> Even then. How about a little AP, Adrian Peterson? That's a 2007 Topps Chrome Rookie Refractor PSA 9. Nice one there for the Vikings going to Lee. And how about a little neon marble variation of Najee Harris and the Steelers that graded a PSA 9. Four out of four. That is for the Steelers and Ed. Uh, I don't think that's first off the line. Neon Marbles is just another variation there. I don't think so, though. Uh, we got a Jalen Waddle die cut, PSA 10. Oh, I feel you, man. Don't worry, man. You're going to get some good stuff here, man. I think uh, there'll be some good Tom Brady's in here, potentially, especially Bucks edition. Wow. Well, this is not Bucks Edition Brady, but of course we start talking about Brady. That is a 2012 Prism Tom Brady base PSA 9. The silvers in that actually sell extremely well. And that is a Patriots Edition of David. Yes, they did actually, Carl. But I don't even think we got to see him play, right? I mean, he was pretty much gone pretty fast. Little Justin Herbert. 2021 Donner's Optic Blue. PSA 9. Little color match there. Number to 179 for the Chargers. That is going to Tristan. But yeah, they did, and it's kind of sad. I think he got to play in like preseason, right? I don't even think he played the regular season. Not that I remember of. And how about a little Joe Burr? Joe Burrow, Justin Beard with the Bengals, no huddle silver, PSA 9. Alrighty, guys. Let me go get a shoebox for these graded cards, and then uh, I'll bring the next cases over. cases of rookies that I see here. So we'll go uh, rookies, football. I think we have two cases. So we'll do that next and then uh, from there on I think we'll move to some platinums, case hits, and then of course continue on uh, with that.
But one of them is Series 4, one of them is Series 5. Just want to make sure. Yeah, Series 4, Series 5. Cool. So we'll go with Series 4 first. So this is Rookie Edition Series 4, and then we'll go to Series 5. Nice! How about a little Zach Wilson? Rookie ticket, uh, refractor for the Jets. And it's going to Adam Kupperman. Lamar Jackson, rated rookie, PSA 10. That is going to the Ravens and Sean Maddox. Najee Harris. This time it's a variation orange rookie ticket, PSA 9. Numbered 11 out of 20. Pittsburgh Steelers. Add with that one. Jamar Chase, Legacy Rookie Auto, number to 99. Bengals, going to Justin. We've hit any of the cell sheet hits here, right? I mean, obviously there's a possibility that we won't hit any of those, but something similar at least. But technically, you know what? We created our own Jaspi one, so I assume actually we will see some of those actually. Saquon Barkley, rated rookie, number to 150 for the G Men, BGS 910. Next box here, and sorry, that's gonna go to the Giants and Michael Davis. Little C D Lamb Origins autograph to ninety nine. Cowboys on the board. Nico Martin. Drew Brees, that is a number to 99, and that is a 2001 Pacific Vanguard. 31 out of 99, graded a BGS 9. There's the subgrades on the back. And that's going to go to the Chargers. Chargers is Tristan. I think that's a rookie Drew Brees. <laughs> I know, right? Next one to hit. For you. I'm not going to think that way. Alright, we got a out of 25. Jalen Waddle, rookie. 
That definitely looks like a first off the line edition or something. Uh, Minnesota, sorry, not Minnesota. Miami Dolphins, Tristan. Debo Samuel, playoff ticket, playoff to 49. 49ers, that's going to uh, Nancy. And the last one here, we'll move on to the next one. And how about a Josh Allen hollow rated rookie? That's pretty sweet. PSA 9. That's going to the Bills and Aaron Billingsley. All righty, cool. There you go. First one in the books. Let's go with the next one. This is Series 5 now, so we're switching it up to Series 5. Nineteen uh, Panini and Case, Rookie Dual Swatch Signature, Sapphire, David Montgomery, 9-5. Inscribe Gold Bears for the Burrs. Uh, Sean Maddox. Knowing now, Justin, I mean, is there even a way that they would cancel the Super Bowl? Or postpone it? There's no way, right? I mean, I guess if the players say no and all unite together, then yeah, I would think they'd have to postpone it and redo it, you know, the next day or whatever, how long it takes. But that's actually pretty interesting because... I feel like honestly, even though it sounds kind of messed up, but I would assume that the the owners and the league is gonna are gonna talk about something like that and have a precaution, you know, have a little plan to, on how to deal with that if that ever happens again, whether it's regular season, postseason, or in the Super Bowl. But if all the players had to had to gather up and say we we don't want to play, then I'd assume they have to postpone. Debo Samuel rookie ticket again. This time it's from Contenders Optic, PSA nine. One of the 49ers. But yeah, I would, I would assume that they would say no. <laughs> You're playing. <laughs> but I guess if the players don't want to, then you're going to force them to play, I guess? I don't think so. Joe Burrow. Die cut blue prism. Light blue prism. Greater to PSA 10. I think that's a pretty good one, Mark. I think the running backs are going to have uh, the most touchdowns, honestly. I, I, I low-key have, like, Miles Sanders potentially winning MVP. But uh, any other running backs, I think, are going to have a chance to score touchdowns for sure. Um... And we have a Justin Jefferson. How about a little die cut zebra rookie for the Minnesota Vikings? Minnesota Lee with that one. Fifty cents, I love it, dude. <laughs> we have Cooper Cup, tricolor rookie prism, Rams edition, PSA ten, and that's uh, try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. That's going to Chad. But yeah, no, I mean Boston Scott or, or Ken Gainwell has been getting a lot of carries lately, 
So that's what I'm saying. I think the running backs have a really good chance of winning it because if they if they score the the touchdowns, I mean, you can't really deny them that, right? I mean, but I have a feeling Miles Sanders is going to break one off this game. He didn't really get to break off a lot of runs this year. A year ago or two years ago, I remember he broke off like three or four 80-yard-plus runs. Kenny Gainwell, or sorry, not Kenny Gainwell, Kenny, uh, Kenneth Walker. RPA to 49. That's for the Seattle Seahawks going to Tristan. But yeah, he hasn't really broken one off this year, really, so I have a feeling that might happen. And how about a little Patrick Mahomesies? 2017 Panini Donruss rated rookie. And again, uh, it is a PSA 8, but these still sell extremely well. And uh, that is going to go to the Kansas City Chiefs and Taylor. Pittsburgh. AJ Brown. And we have a George Pickens to 149. Ricky Patch autograph for the Pittsburgh Steelers going ahead. And how about for the Bucks? Mike Evans. BGS 9. And it is 7 out of 10. Mike Evans. Go to the Buccaneers and Ryan on the board. We got CD Lamb RPA to 35 for the Dallas Cowboys. All right, there you go. So two more cases down. So I think we're 40 boxes in. Let's put all the graded stuff there. Put this stuff here. And let's go grab the next set. So again. That's a big one, that's a big one. Then after Platinum, we'll do Sapphire, which is going to be a, a little bit more expensive product right there. And then we'll throw in the two loose case hit boxes, and then we'll give you a little taste of what potentially a big, big product is right there, if you haven't seen VIP yet. So this is VIP Chairman. I think this is the biggest hit parade product they offer. That's like well over $1,000 a box. So we'll do that after. So we'll go with... Two case hits, we'll go to Platinum, Sapphire, and then we'll do the VIP. Then after that, we have a case of the one of ones, so one of a kind. Then we have three cases of the big game Jaspies edition. Then actually, guys, honestly, I think I'm going to be done pretty fast. Honestly, actually. I feel like I'm just running right through this. I might be done with this like in two hours. So i got to go through a couple jerseys, of course, like 20 jerseys and, and helmets, but I think we're making great time.
No, Chad. If we would have done that, that actually would have been pretty cool, but... No. <laughs> All right, so this is Kate's edition. Everything is a case hit here, guys. Let's see what we got. And it is a stained glass rookie, Mac Jones. Nice stained glass. Mac Daddy Jones. That is going to David. No, I know, Chad. <laughs> Dude, this is easy, Justin. This is like the easiest sort ever for 127 boxes. And we got a little Barry Sanders. Downtown for the Lions. Lions with that one going to Tim. I know, that would be kind of cool, right? It was a mid-break trade like where you can trade your current and future hits. See, those stuff sounds really fun, but, man, some people would get so mad if it ended up not going in their favor. We'd have to, like, establish, like, you're signing a waiver. <laughs> you know, so people don't, uh, be like, no, nah, that wasn't even me. I, I didn't trade them. I didn't agree to this. I mean, obviously, there has been breaks where, like, you know, like Chad brought up, like, after so many boxes or whatever, we switch randomize the teams again, but it's just, it's, for a break like this, is, I don't know, it's kind of tough. But, you know, a break like this, since I started from, like, the least amount to the highest amount, I don't think anybody would want to trade, right? I mean, think about it. I haven't even got to the really expensive stuff where those are make or break right there. So technically, I don't know if that'd be actually, uh, that even would be a good thing. Imagine you just like trade the Chiefs away right now. You're just like, yeah, Chiefs suck. I don't want them. And then all of a sudden you start pulling all the Patrick Mahomes. DK Metcalf, 2019 Prism Red Ice. PSA 10. It's going to go to the Seattle Seahawks. Actually, guys, I think I'm already done with this bag. Scary. Justin Jefferson. No huddle prism, short print, PSA ten. Very nice. I don't remember if the Jaguars are even on the block though, Tristan. I don't even know if Mike was actually even here to see that. 
But yeah, of course, given the opportunity. Whoa, Marvels! How about that? Kyle Pitts from 2021 Donruss. Donruss football does come out on Wednesday, guys. So if you do go hit this in this, unfortunately, you will get a box of 2022 Donruss. And that's going to go to try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo, David, uh, David May. But remember, guys, the hitless prizes is just the box of Donruss. Everybody, whether you go hitless or not, gets a chance, of course, at the Sapphire or at the Football Case Hits Series 14, which is a $3,000 value. And how about Jalen Hurts? There we go. That's our first Eagles hit right there. Die Cut Neon Green Prism PSA 10. Fly goes fly, go birds. That's going to Carl. Micah Parsons, Blue Scope, 2021 Donner's Optic, PSA 10. That is going to go to the Dallas Cowboys. And that is Nico. I think he's going to be a future Eagle. I think if he gets the opportunity to be a free agent, he's going to go to Philly. He's basically a Philadelphia Eagles fan. He won't admit it now, but he is. Justin Herbert, Blue Scope, Donner's Optic Rookie, PSA 10. That is a sweet card right there. That is for the Chargers, Tristan. And a little Justin Fields for the Bears, Sean Maddock. That is a red, oh, red, white, and blue die cut, PSA 10 from Select. That is Chicago Bears. And we have a pink cameo from retail. Or right, that's a uh, red, white, and blue pack, right? Or not blue, uh, cello pack. PSA 9, Joe Burr. I do not, Willem. I, I don't work Sundays and Mondays, so. During football season, I love it. But yeah, man, I'm excited. I'm going to throw a little big party at my mom's. Not little big, but it's pretty big. Uh, with friends and family, so it should be fun. And look at that. How about a little Marshawn Lynch? Bills. Rookie Refractor. Bowman Chrome. Bills. But Aaron Billingsley. And a Tom Brady, 2000 Pacific Crown Royale Rookie, which of course is a New England Patriot, PSA 7, and a Patriot there, that is uh, David. Now of course too, I mean, I think if you went on the checklist for this, it might still say Patriots on it, since a lot of those were just like college Patriots, but he is officially retired now, so... We go to the team we played for the longest, which of course would be Patriots. But of course, if he's Bucks uniform, goes to Bucks, Patriots, Patriots, etc. A nice hit there for the Patriots. All right, now we're gonna go to Sapphire, guys. Series three, 2022. So this is a little bit more expensive product here. This is more like a five, six hundred dollar box, which I assume floor at worst is like two, two fifty, maybe somewhere around there, two hundred, and then ceiling in this could probably be triple the spot price, maybe. So maybe fifteen hundred. So that actually, these boxes might actually have a lot of heat. So here we go.
And we have a Justin Herbert rookie autograph that graded a PSA 8 Auto 10. And that is on the sell sheet, I believe. I think I've seen it on there. No? Different one? Oh, that's probably a different Herbert. But nice little Herbie. For the Chargers and Tristan. So again, you're going to see much nicer cards in this, in this product here. And we have a Emmett Smith Flawless Signatures. Graded the autograph, which is a 10, authentic grade, 10 of 10. Nice break for the Cowboys. And a Kyler Murray RPA from Origins Football, 33 out of 49. Cardinals going to David Lemons. Dual autograph, Kirk Cousins, Justin Jefferson. Five out of 49. Minnesota Vikings. Another Vikings having a good break too, Lee. With that one. Jamar Chase RPA. 2021 Immaculate. I Black RPA to 99. Graded a PSA 8. But a nice hit there for the Bengals. Justin Beard. Alright, halfway through, guys. Another five boxes here now. Alvin Johnson for the Lions. How about that? 2007. Number to 149. PSA 9. Detroit Lions. Tim with that one. Four more here. Najee Harris, flawless rookie autograph to 20, graded a BGS 9, 10. Nice break for the Steelers. Uh, that's also Ed. Downtown Devontae Smith. That is nice. And it graded a PSA 10. I actually have one of these. It's just not graded. Fly goes fly. And there you go, Carl. PSA 10, Devontae Smith. Had an amazing sophomore year. Tom Brady, red, white, and blue, PSA 10 prism. Very nice. Patriots. That's going to uh, David. All right, one more box, guys, and then we'll go with VIP.
And it's a printing plate, one of one, Dan the Man Marino. Looks like it was a redemption as well. On, or sorry, not on play, that's actually a sticker. But, very nice one of one for the Dolphins and Tristan. Alrighty. So here we go. This is VIP Chairman, guys. This is such a big product. Hopefully we get a massive hit here. Let's go. Hoping for a massive hit. And it's Aaron Rodgers to 10 for the Green Bay Packers. I don't even know if I called the Packers name yet, but Steve Herrick, there you go. Nice Aaron Rodgers. Alrighty, guys. So again, all I have left here is a case of one-of-a-kind, one-of-ones. Then I have the three curated uh, big hit Jaspi Hit Parade exclusives. And then I have four helmets and then two jersey boxes, so... Still pretty much a little ways to go, but we're almost there, actually. I kind of want to do the big game exclusives all together, so let's go with the one of a kind. So, every one of these cards is going to be a one of one, guys. Every single one of them. One of ones. This one's going to be a pretty big one. Excuse me, I didn't want to be sneezing on the cards. <laughs> Alright, here we go. First one is a Amonra St. Brown for the Lions. Woo! Big time receiver there. There you go, of course. That is a rookie for the Detroit Lions. Going to Tim. One of one. Had him on my fantasy this year, man. It was amazing. So there's your first one of one. Thank you, Carl. Appreciate it, man. Ooh, got a graded card. Graded. Oh, this must be the big hit. Oh, snap. We'll send you a $100 gift code when you share this card with you, so... Whoever gets this is going to also get a $100 gift code to Hit Parade. This must be a massive hit, guys. Two thousand and nineteen Panini National Convention Autographs. Patrick Mahomes, one of one. <laughs> Damn. That's going to go to the Chiefs. And Taylor, who got last spot mojo, bought it straight up. Damn, that's a big hit right there. And he signed out Patrick Mahomes, too. Graded a 9-5-10. Big fan of Mahomes. I just hope he doesn't win this weekend. <laughs> well, there you go. So, you'll get this code with you. Uh, I don't know. You have to ask Taylor. I don't even know if he's watching. So there you go. How awesome is it that we probably get one of the biggest one of ones in the one of a kind in a mixer? It's pretty cool. 
Well, I don't expect everything else to be nearly as good, but we still got one on ones here, though. So let's keep it going. Damn, they stick these cards in here perfect. And we have a one of one, Philip Rivers. Little Nike swoosh and autograph. Chargers. Good as gold. Nice one there for the Chargers, and that is going to Tristan. One of one, Philip Rivers. And a one of one Big Ben Roethlisberger. Char uh, Steelers also having a break. Nice one there for the Steelers going to Ed. Remember, guys, this is all one of one, so. Ooh, looks like we have another graded card one of one. Let's take a look. 2021 Mosaic, Jerry Rice in it to win it, Black Mosaic, one of one, graded at PSA 9. Nice one there for the 49ers going to Nancy. And we have a one of one Aaron Jones for the Green Bay Packers. Green Bay Packers at Steve Herrick. Statistical standouts, Marshall Falk, one of one. Patch autograph. Rams, Chad Cromwell, try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Don't worry, Tristan, it could change, man. It could change. Living Legends 1 of 1, Larry Fitzgerald. Very nice. Cardinals, David Lemons. All right, two more, guys. This is the last box they numbered. This is box 100 of 100. And it is Amari Cooper, one of one. Gold vinyl for the Cowboys. Cowboys having a good break too, Nico. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. Last one here. 58 out of 100. And then we're going to move on to the big game Jaspi edition. And those are the ones that we curated with. Uh, with Hit Parade. Wow, Barry Sanders one of one. That's two one of ones for the lines in this. Diamond one of one. There you go. Alright guys, well hey, I mean obviously this is by far the biggest one right there in the case, but still one of ones for a lot of different teams here. And let's keep this show going.
All right, so, again, just an FY, you know, we're kind of, I'd say we're pretty much more than halfway there. Only an hour in. Um, I have the three cases left there of the big game. So let me just show you guys. Those are the three cases right there. And then we have the two jersey cases and then all the uh, helmets. So I'm going to grab one case at a time because it's kind of big and both of them don't really fit on there. And then after, the, after that, we're just going to go straight to the memorabilia. We're doing great on time, actually. I mean, I did pause the video for like 10 minutes, so we did like save 10 minutes, but still, I mean, that's still not like at least long enough, too. So yeah, we're doing great on time. I might finish this under two hours. I guess I underestimated it. I mean, I might be breaking too fast for some people's likings, but it's just one card, so it's not like take too long for it, you know? I'd rather get this done quick and do some other stuff, right? Alright, so these are the big games, guys. Big games. And this is case one of three. Alright. Sorry if that made a loud noise, though, guys. I didn't expect it to fall like that. Ooh, look at that. Big game. Jaspi logo. Shoo. Love it. So again, I don't know how many of those sell sheet hits are actually part of this, but I would figure that since it is three cases worth, there's probably a good amount. And we specifically made this for our mixer, so good luck, guys. These ones should be pretty fun. And how about a Kenny Pickett? Triple Relic and Autograph. To 199 for the Steelers. And again, Steelers having a great break, which is add. Twenty twenty flawless Jalen Hurts Sapphire graded a PSA ten, three out of ten. Nice one there for my Eagles, going to Carl. So that was actually on the sell sheet. Very nice, Jalen. Sorry about that, guys. We got a Justin Fields Obsidian Autograph for the Bears to 100. Chicago Bears. That is going to uh, Sean Maddock. I know the one thing Tristan is I don't I was actually looking at that card right now I don't know if that's actually part of this series because if it is it's definitely in here or it's just a potential big hit in a hit parade product that we just opened but we're gonna find out whoa NFL shields How about a little Nick Chubb one of one nice Nick Chubb big time running back there Zach with the Browns try to trade couldn't trade mojo How about a little Peyton Manning? Swatch Supremacy, I think it is. Yeah. 13 out of 50. Little patch autograph. And that's uh, on card as well, I believe. Nice one for the Indianapolis Colts. Going to Tristan.
And we got a DK Metcalf PSA 9 select gold field level for the Seattle Seahawks. 5 out of 10. And that is going to Tristan and the Seahawks. Rob Gronkowski, one out of five, 2012 Prime Signatures Platinum. Graded a BGS 9 for the Patriots. Going to David. How about a little Herbie? Red, green choice. PSA 10 rookie. Chargers having an amazing break. Tristan. We have Trey Lance. This one's really stuck with the hell. That is a rated rookie autograph, and uh, not numbered, but it might be from a retail then, because it it's like orange, but it's not numbered. Nice one there for the 49ers and Nancy. All right, one more box, guys, and then we'll get the second case going. And how about a little kaboom? Kaboom! Tyreek Hill. Kansas City Chiefs edition. Which again, Chiefs haven't hit too much, but they've hit a 101 Patrick Mahomes, which is way more than enough now. Taylor with that one. Case two. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll most likely probably show it again. Don't worry. 
All right, so again, this is case number two now of the Big Game Mixer, or the Big Game uh, Jaspi Edition Hit Parade. Here we go, next one. Uh, does I would assume there's a couple. I think uh, Tristan was keeping track. I think his, I think his uh, Panthers were. I don't think I've seen any Jaguars just yet. Not that I remember of. We didn't get an ETM, didn't we earlier? No. I don't think so. But yeah, I don't think it's that many, though, honestly. I mean, some teams have only gotten hits, like one hit, but they've got something, though. But it's not too many, really. Aaron Rodgers, White Sparkle, PSA 10. That's pretty nice. So the Eagles win or lose the Super Bowl, Aaron. I'm superstitious now. Justin Jefferson, Formula One. Do a relic and autograph, 1099. Oh, no, Jets have gotten hits for sure. Jets have gotten hits. There was also a Zach Wilson autograph earlier, too. It's, I don't think it's more than like four or five, honestly. I really don't, but you can see. A hitless team gets a box of Donner's football that releases on Wednesday. I think it's like a 200 to 50 $300 box. And Zeke, one of one. That's a rookie Ezekiel Elliott Panini encased. Very nice. Graded a BGS 9. And that's going to go to the Dallas Cowboys. Having a, having a break. Having a break. About more Jamar Chase. Legacy rookie autos to 50. Bengals. Yeah, I think it was, for me, if I'm correct, I think it was just Panthers. Actually, you know what? I don't think I've called the Broncos number yet. So I think definitely Panthers, Broncos. Maybe Texans. Jaguars, no. So what is that, four maybe? And then maybe like the Titans and Commanders. So yeah, like six maybe? Yeah. What? Whoa! There's a Tilo. <laughs> that is a 2021 Prism White. Field level graded out of uh, sorry, graded a nine five, but it's numbered eleven out of thirty five. That's a very very nice hit there. There you go. So hitless no more for the Jaguars going to Mike. And hitless no more for the Titans as well. Derrick Henry, downtown. 
So there you go. We'll check it off too. And for the Giants, Daniel Jones, 2020 downtown. G-Man, let's go to Michael Davis. And a Matthew Stafford, two out of five. 2016 Panini Impeccable Elegance Veteran Patch Autographs. Greater to BGS 8, but still a nice one there, though. Lions also having a really good break, Tim. Couple 101s in that 101 one of a kind. stuck but it's a jk dobbins nice true rpa 92 out of 99 baltimore Ravens, sean maddock hey we still have another case and we still have a lot of graph jerseys too guys you know obviously i know we want the cards but autograph jerseys autograph mint uh, autograph full-size helmets obviously are pretty nice but after this boss we have one more case of cards at least And for the Saints, Drew Brees, Mus um, Mystique, Mar or Mystic Mark, sorry. 17 out of 20, plates and patches on card. Saints, Matt Buckler. Alrighty, guys. So I don't know if the Saints were a hitless team or not, but I think we checked off at least three there, right? If the Saints were Titans and then Jaguars. So like I said, I, we're going to try to keep track. I think Panthers for sure. Raiders, I think, uh, haven't got one. And Titans and Commanders maybe. So four maybe so far. <laughs> I don't know, man. We only created three cases of this. And we got Saquon Barkley. Rookie ticket. 9-5-10 for the Giants. That was the first hit. Devontae Smith, Genesis. Fly goes fly right there, baby. Nice one there for Carl. Wow. 
Wow, another Patrick Mahomes. Are you kidding me? That is 2019 Immaculate Collection, Immaculate Moments out of 25. 9 out of 25. So this Mahomes was part of our our uh, Hit Parade Big Game Mixer case. And I guess the T-Law was also a, a sell sheet hit too. So the T-Law must have been the big hit on the first case, and then this one might be the big hit on the second case. The other Mahomes, I don't think we were expecting to hit that. That, that was part of just one of a kind. We just got lucky on that one. But very nice there, man. And again, Chiefs. Taylor's got two Patrick Mahomes coming his way. That is crazy. And we got a Kyler Murray Silver Prism Select PSA 10. Cardinals going to David. Commanders are Jeff Hen, Tristan. You only have the Seahawks, the Dolphins, the Chargers, the Colts, and the Panthers. And Tua, Togo by Loa. That is a XRC Prism Redemption, PSA 10. Dolphins, that's going to Tristan. Alright, halfway through, guys. Again, we still have the autograph helmets. We still have the autograph jerseys. There's 20 different autograph jerseys. There's four helmets. And then, of course, even at then, you still have a chance to win that $3,000 case of case hits, hit parade, which is a $3,000 value. And how about a Kirk Cousins? Commanders. Check them off. Boom. That is a 2012... Uh, Prism Rookie Signature, 9510. That's pretty sweet, out of 499. So there you go, Jeff Hen on the board. And for the Colts, Jonathan Taylor, Purple Prism PSA 10. That is 19 out of 125. All right, three more boxes. And how about a Christian McCaffrey, the He's kind of falling off there. But it is a pristine 10. Almost a perfect card. 2017 Rookie Prisms. Pristine 10. And check off the Panthers now. I think Brian's right, man. I think Raiders are the only one so far. I think that's it, right? I think we've got at least one hit for almost everybody else. Let's pull for a Raiders here, here, guys. If not, some jerseys are full-size helmets. I think Raiders might be the last team, unfortunately. Let's go, let's go, let's get big Raiders hit. Something, give me something. Tom Brady Genesis MVPs, 9-5. That's pretty sweet there. Tampa Bay Buccaneers, that is going to Ryan G. St. Brown. 
Great break for the Lions, 6 out of 10. Texans? Oh, actually, that's true, right? Uh, I don't know, actually, if we haven't hit the Texans yet. I mean, I'll, I'll re-go through everything again. But yeah, I think the biggest hit by far is this one right here. 101 Patrick Mahomes. No, it was in the one of a kind. Ah, Sean Maggie, are you keeping track? Yeah. All right. Well, so far, just those two. But again, they could be in the autographs, helmets, or jerseys still. But if not, at least a box of Donner is coming your way. I mean, either way, guys, we're going to sort it out anyway, so don't worry. It's not like we're going to be like, no, you did get something. We're not going to ship you a box. But if you can keep track of it now, it's better. Rams also had a Goff, I remember as well. A Goff rookie. I guess so, Adam. They're just like screw the screw the Jets. We're gonna give them a Joe Namath and a Zach Wilson in another case. So who cares? All right, so this one's actually pretty cool. These ones are officially licensed autograph jerseys. So these are gonna be really nice jerseys, actually. Officially licensed. Actually, why am I stacking them up here? I don't think they fit. Alright, let's, uh, let's raise this up a little bit since I'm going to be standing. Alright, officially licensed, guys. First one, we're not going to be doing any who am I, I'm just going to go through them. Well, complain, complain about no hit parade in the Jaspies edition, Adam. But how about a little Garrett Wilson autographed jersey? They're like, alright, 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 we're going to give him an autographed jersey. And again, it is officially licensed. There's the tags right there. $140 jersey. So I don't want to take it out of the bag because I'm, I'm definitely not good at folding clothes, but that is an officially licensed Garrett Wilson. For the Cowboys, Micah Parsons, Nico with that one.
There's a jersey. Again, all officially licensed, guys. Well, I think they saved like $15 million if they cut him, Tristan, which I think they are. I think it's time for them to move on. You got to get under the cap. All right, so uh, Nico with the Cowboys. Well, there'll definitely be a lot of suitors for him. I can see him going to like a team that's just like a receiver away, you know? I mean, he doesn't he's not the number 1 guy anymore. He just gets injured too much. But you know, I can see him going to, you know, maybe like a Jaguars maybe, I don't know. Maybe a Cowboys, right? They kind of need a second, third receiver. Um, you know. Something like that. Patriots maybe. I don't know. He's still going to get you productive yardage, but he just might be injured for a couple games out of the year. And uh, Taylor. Is that Fred, Fred Taylor? I think that is Fred Taylor. But I think they put him in a new Jaguars jersey. Yeah, I think they put him in a new Jaguars jersey. We'll see. It's an extra large. Right, I guess I have to open this one up to double check. There you go. Fred Taylor. Jaguars. Going to Mike. Next one. And this one's a Collins. Is that Landon Collins? Giants Landon Collins? Yeah, Landon Collins. So Giants, Michael Davis. Why would the Texans trade for Zach Wilson, Matt Adam? <laughs> he is definitely not worth the first round right now. Giants, that's my goodness. Oh, I didn't see that. I mean, he won't get traded for the number two pick, that's for sure. <laughs> I guess it's possible. Dude, come on, guys. The Texans are drafting Bryce Young. I mean, why are we trying to skip around this? The Texans are drafting Bryce Young.
The Bears don't need him. They got Fields. They're gonna take somebody else and trade it, but they're getting the Texans are drafting Bryce Young. And that is a Lions edition jersey of TJ Hawkinson. Nice Lions jersey there. Lions. That's Tim. I mean, that's a possibility, but I, I highly really doubt it, though. But, I mean, I don't want to rule it out, but I, all I'm saying is that if the Texans, if the Houston doesn't trade, I'm oh, sorry, not Houston, if the Bears don't trade Fields and get a quarterback, I mean, obviously they have to trade Fields first, but if they don't trade Fields, they're not, they're not picking a quarterback. So... I think it's time the Texans get themselves a nice stud right there. I mean, they did pretty well to Sean Watson. It just didn't work out, of course, obviously. And... Hafunga! Nice! That's a 49er. I think that's a Palomalu's, like, mentor, right? Or men uh, men Palomalu's a mentor? Kind of plays like Palomalo. That is 49ers, Nancy. Yeah, I wasn't expecting a Hafunga either, bro. We got one. Nice Rams Cam Akers jersey, though. There's a little Rams logo right there. Looks like they're kind of lower this down. Oh, maybe actually we should hire it up, right? Cam Akers, there's the autograph right there. Rams, that is, uh, Chad. Three more boxes here of the officially licensed, then we'll move to the next series. And Chase Claypool, Steelers edition. How did he sign? I don't see no signature on the 11. Oh, there it is. Sorry, he didn't sign on the 11. He signed right there. It's Claypool Steelers. Steelers jersey. I don't know if Hip Parade would really want to do that. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if it was a Derek Carr or Chad Bailey, but... I don't know about uh, Henry Ruggs, though. <laughs> and Steelers with Ed.
Savage, Jeremy. <laughs> All right, what do you think has been the best jersey we've hit so far? I don't know if they specifically make, like, case hits out of jerseys, but I just, I'd assume they do. Bears! Oh, sorry, not Bears. I thought that was uh, Cole Komet. Sorry, sorry. It's my fault. I thought that was Cole Komet there for a second. That's T. Higgins. Damn. I was going to say, Yes! <laughs> All right. That is T. Higgins, and I don't know. Is Higgins going to stay? I don't really know. Higgins might be asking for too much money. My thing is that, like, I'm not saying the Super Bowl window closed for the Bengals, but you're going to have to pay Joe Burrow, right? T. Higgins already wants a big contract. Jamar Chase is going to get a big contract at some point, right, too? A year later? I mean, and then you're going to have to pay, you know, other players. I mean, it's going to be kind of tough. They're going to have to try to manage it as good as possible. And then I think Joe Mixon's a free agent, isn't he? Joe Mixon probably wants to get paid. Uh, that's Bengals going to Justin. So we'll see how it goes, but it could be a totally potentially different team, but we don't know yet, obviously. I mean, that's good, but is Chase going to want to have a friendly contract? Is T. Higgins going to want to have a friendly contract? Is Joe Mixon going to want to have a friendly contract? I mean, you can only do so many friendlies, right? Because, I mean, Burrow can, right? He's, he's going to get paid out of the most out of all of them. He can spare a couple mil. I mean, at the end of the day, I think they just convert it into, like, guaranteed money and signing bonuses. But still, you know, not everybody could be that friendly. <laughs> Everybody's situation is totally different. Whoa! Is that Raiders? Josh Jacobs. There you go. Very nice. Led the NFL in rushing yards. He's definitely going to get paid. There you go. On the board, Raiders. Brian. the next one guys I don't know if this one actually is officially licensed but this one is a hit parade autograph football series 8 the other one was officially licensed this one might be customs but obviously it doesn't mean they're still bad players or anything like that it's just not going to be an officially licensed jersey but honestly if you're going to frame it it doesn't really matter
All right, let's continue on. And you know, to be honest, guys, I know we're trying to get everybody to get a hit, but I, I honestly, I think for a big mixture like this, this has been pretty successful for the hitting part because I've done bigger mixers. And the one thing about the hit parade is that obviously, you know, we've got the majority of the teams to get hits, but I've had other bigger mixtures like this Super Bowl ones where there's been way more hit lists. Now, granted, of course, we ripped prison boxes, we ripped this, so they got rookies and base, but no hits, you know? Because I remember one time, I think we had to ship out like 10, 10, 12 boxes worth of stuff because there were so many teams that went hitless. So I think for a break like this, I mean, to only have two teams so far is not that bad. Because we know how mixtures can go, right? With other with other mixtures, it could be crazy. All right, Cole Beasley to start us off, and that is a custom Bills jersey. Bills, Aaron Billingsley. Another Chase Claypool. This time this one's going to be custom, so if anything, Ed, you can sell the custom, keep the officially licensed, or vice versa. Next one. Is that Hunter Renfro? It is Hunter Renfro. Great as he had a really good season last year, but kind of battled some concussions and injuries and didn't have the greatest season, but. Another hit for the Raiders, though, but, uh, Brian. Man, that's cool. Yeah, I've, I've, I've seen that dude before, too. I forgot where I got to see him. I didn't really get to talk to him, though, but I've seen him somewhere. And yeah, he was pretty famous for a couple couple months when he was uh, coming out as a magician. That's some really cool tricks uh, on, like, uh, I think it was a Monday, Sunday, or something like that. Also came out in, uh, I think, what, America's Got Talent. How about a Trayvon Diggs? And actually, I think this one actually is an officially licensed one. Some of them are. Yeah, it is. It's a Nike one. Some of them are, some of them are not, but nice Trayvon Diggs. So Trayvon Diggs for the Cowboys. How's it going? Good.
Cowboys is Nico. Yeah, he had uh, something to do with his heart that forced him to retire. Yeah, I think he was the Eagles' long snapper for a little bit. Was that Joe Namath? No, it's Alan Lazard. I thought that was Joe Namath for a second. Uh, Alan Lazard, that is Green Bay Packers. Steve Herrick. Steve Herrick, there you go, man. Here we go. Next one. I think we're halfway through now. Ugh. Whoa. Is that one of those like uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers jerseys? That Cameron Brait. Oh, that's right. Name it is 12, huh? <laughs> I don't know. I see the similar green, maybe. That's what threw me off. I forgot Name it was 12. But yes, I did hear that, right? Uh, Name it said he would let him use 12. I bet you uh, the Jets are saying, you better let this dude use 12. <laughs> All right, so Cameron Brait, that's a Buccaneers jersey, Ryan. Wow. All right. Honestly, dude, he looks so weird in a Jets uniform. I've seen the mock-ups. You can't tell me he does not look weird in a Jets uniform. Well, Eric, the Chiefs might have only had like three hits, but they got a Kaboom, uh, Tyreek Hill, they got a Patrick Mahomes graded autograph, and they got a 9-5-10, 1-1 Patrick Mahomes autograph. So I'd probably have to say them. <laughs> but there was a lot of teams like the Chargers... Um, Steelers, you know, uh, a lot of different teams hit a lot. Ooh, is that Khalil Mack? And this is officially licensed as well. Khalil Mack Bears. The Bears. Going to Sean Maddock. You know what, though? I got used to Brady as a, as a Buccaneer, though. I did. Maybe maybe that's what it is. We just have to adjust, right? But no. I, I think Aaron Rodgers would just look way weirder in a Jets uniform. Brady, I, I got used to, though. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I think it's just the, that he's coming from one color green to another, you know? And that's Bear Sean Maddox.
good. Dolphins. Grant Sr. That is Joaquim Grant. Joaquim Grant. Is that an old school guy, or that just doesn't bring up? Or is that a new guy? Uh, wide receiver return specialist. Played for the Dolphins for like six years, it looks like. Second team All-Pro 2020, 2021. With the Bears and Browns. I don't remember this guy, but... Was a six round pick, and that's Dolphins edition. So, Miami Dolphins, that's going to be Tristan. All right, two more boxes here, guys, and then we will go to the helmets, and I got four of them. Four helmets. <sighs> Number 82, hut, hut. Is that Mario Manningham? Holy shit. <laughs> Mario Manningham. That's definitely a Giants jersey. Giants going to Michael Davis. Better than David Tyrese? No, he had one in the second Super Bowl. I don't know. David Tyrese but probably is still the best one. Actually, no. Julian Edelman's catch is probably better than that now. That was ridiculous that the ball didn't hit the ground. Um, Giants again. Michael Davis. Our last box of jerseys, guys. We've got four helmets left. Inscribed. Is that Jacoby Myers? Yeah, Jacoby Myers. New England Patriots going to David. Three helmets there. Let's raise this B up a little bit. So 
So this is Diamond Edition Series 4. I don't know what that means. I don't know if that means they're going to be nice high-end ones or what, but we're going to find out together. It looks like Dallas Cowboys. It looks like Dak Prescott auto. I don't think this was auto penned, right? There you go. Dakota Prescott. Very, very nice. Officially licensed full size helmet. There's the ink right there. Dallas Cowboys, great break. Nico, there you go, man. Here we go, next one. Oh wow, is this a... Uh... The Green Bay Packers. It's like one of those uh, custom ones, right? I guess we can look up the hauling room. Oh wait, it usually says it in the box. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see this, but. Alan Lazard. All right. Well, that's kind of a cool helmet. 
Green Bay Packers. That's going to Steve Harris. So, kind of like a little custom helmet, Packers. It's really cool. Green Bay Packers, Steve Herrick. All right, guys, down to the final two helmets. Here we go. Again, you still have a chance to win a sealed case of Case Hits Football Hit Parade. It's like a $3,000 value. I'm pretty much nearing the end. I believe San Francisco 49ers. Nice little custom one. And inside the box, that's Steve Young. Steve Young. It's a very nice helmet, actually. I like these custom helmets, they look cool. In the one of a kind Rex, you hit the one of one Patrick Mahomes autograph. All right, and then uh, 49ers, that is uh, Nancy. All right, you guys, down to the final box of the mixer. I really appreciate you guys filling this up. I know some people bought straight up spots. I know some people won spots from the hit fillers. But at the end of the day, guys, you know, I still appreciate everything, all the orders. You know, I know, I know it took a little bit to get this done, a lot of fillers. Uh, but it's, it's been a pretty fun break and can't wait for the next big mixer. The 
over again. After this box, it's not over yet. We still have that $3,000 case giveaway. And if anything, I might even do a hit recap after this in a separate video too. All right, here we go, guys. Good luck. Red uh, face mask. Woo! Nice break for the Chiefs. I believe that's Travis Kelsey. That's a really interesting color. Yep. Travis Kelsey. Kansas City Chiefs autograph full size helmet. It's pretty awesome. And again, Kansas City Chiefs may have not gotten that many hits. Taylor, last spot mojo, but probably got the biggest hits of the whole mixer. And just like that, guys, the mixer is done zo. All right, guys. So let's switch scenes now, guys. Switching scenes. And let's do the giveaway. I'll do a hit recap after, guys. Let's just do the randomizers here. But yeah, it looks like Broncos and uh, Texans were the only two teams that didn't get hits. So you guys got hitless protection to get a box of 2022 Donner's Football Hobby, which I believe comes out on Wednesday. And uh, I think it's like a $250 box. So, not too shabby there. Something better than nothing. But uh, everybody now gets the opportunity to win the case of Sapphire Case Hits Series 14, near $3,000 value. So, here's the dice roller, here's the customer names. Here we go. Let's roll. Two and a two, four times. One, two, three, four. Four times. Here we go. Four, four. Just missing out was Tim, all the way down to Chad. But congratulations to Nancy with the 49ers. Nancy, nice break. Getting a sealed case of Case Hits Football Hit Parade, which is about a $3,000 value. So there you go, guys. In a separate video, I'll do a little hit recap. And uh, you guys can see potentially what hits you guys may have missed. Uh, but again, this was the Big Game Hit Parade Jaspies Mixer. 127 boxes. Appreciate it, guys. Have a great night. Enjoy the Super Bowl. 
Go Birds.